This time on How Do Hackers Do Things, I'm going to show you how a hacker can clone your website and use that to lend credibility to their phishing campaigns. In this example, we're going to use two freely available downloads for the Kali Linux distribution, HTT Track, which allows me to clone a website, and we're going to use Simple Python uh, HTTP server, which will allow me to present that website on a DigitalOcean instance. So let's make a HTTP track directory, and we're going to go ahead and clone example.com. Now that we've cloned it, we're going to go ahead and use our simple HTTP server to serve it up. Now that this is being served up, our next step is to create a believable URL. And to do that, we're going to use no IP. So let's jump over and look at that step. No IP is a DNS resolution service that allows anyone to redirect an IP to a human readable URL. In this case, we're going to take our DigitalOcean IP and redirect it to a new Gravox sounding account. So let's do that real quick. I'm just going to pick one of these down here. Actually, I like this one a little better. Yeah. Now let's input the IP address from our DigitalOcean and let's create that. And now what we can do is go back over to that new human readable URL and it should show us our example.com and there we have it. So why is this bad and how can you prevent it? The simple answer is, is that a malicious actor can clone and steal your website and lend credibility to any number of campaigns whether that is harvesting credentials, phishing, or any other malicious activity that is targeted at your company. There are many ways to prevent this, through knowing what your vulnerability exposure is, through brand monitoring and domain monitoring. We at Greybach specialize in these various tools and techniques to help you prevent and mitigate these types of attacks. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. My name is Josh Jenkins, and I'm an information security consultant at Greybach & Associates.